bafo bafo nu mi ndaka me ma ve do no na ku daka me we si be me je ba bafo nu mi bo ve do ya me ye na ku do seri ni ma ki te pa ya ke je ve mu ri da la kale be me je ba bafo nu mi bo ve do ya me badagoi is the second largest town in lagos state the commercial heartbeat of nigeria it historically accommodated the awuis egun yoruba and ogu people Many wonder why Badagwe is so prominent in the chronicles of the Nigerian modern civilization. When we talk of Badagri, in fact, there is a state that says a uh, gateway. Badagri should be the gateway of civilization of everything to Nigeria. Because before we turn to Christianity, it is through Badagri. The first school is through Badagri. The first uh, story building, Badagri. The slave uh, release is in Badagri. In fact, I can say Badagri opens the gate to civilization to Nigeria. In Zentale, we have so many first in Badagri. We have the first story building in Nigeria, in Badagri built by the missionaries. We also have the popular Gia tree where Christianity was first preached in Nigeria. And aside that, we have the first primary school in Nigeria, which is St. Thomas Primary School. So we have uh, the slave relics there at Buhiko. You know, these are areas of uh, historic importance to us in Madagri. The hospitable disposition of Badagwe people is remarkable and second to none in the country. Coupled with this is the very rich and highly celebrated culture of its people. Our traditional uh, worshippers, they have some voduns. When, they, when you see them dancing with those voduns, you will admire it too. I can say it's part of what makes Badagri a uh, tourism area. Then we have coconut trees that makes Badagri to be one of the towns that have more coconut than any other town in Nigeria today. I can't see of any other country, but in Nigeria, Badagri has the largest coconut farm. We have a very rich culture here, and our tradition is very, very entertaining, I would say. We love, you know, having these stores, and we, we, we welcome them. And it's a very peaceful environment. Because of that, we, we are peace-loving people in Badagri. Apart from all these centers Badagri is endowed with, the town is great for the peace and quietness it offers to tourists and anyone seeking a gateway from the also and bustle of life. No wonder the first settlers of Europeans picked the choice of Badagwe as their initial base. In the words of Lawrence Black, our happiest moment as tourists always seems to come when we stumble upon one thing, why in pursuit of something else? In a bid to make Badagwe more attractive to tourists, the Lagos State Government has added the construction of an ultramodern theater into the long list of tourist centers in the Asian town. Hence, it is opening this new great edifice by December for public use during the festive period. Let's hear what the community people are saying about this. The theater something is very, very good, more especially this area. It will improve the standard of living this side, at least create employment and also make this very place look uh, more good and beautiful. And we pray that as much things like this will be established here. I feel very, very, very happy because it will serve as an alternative to National Theatre at Igamo. We will see how something like this at Igamo. So this is very, it's a welcome idea. I love it personally because it will still promote our um culture and tradition i believe with this theater in badagri those are our people that are good in theater that 
they don't have money to go and establish, to go and uh, watch uh, film their films. So it's an opportunity for them. Because there are a lot of talented people that has opportunity to watch their film, but one thing or the other disturb them. But with this, I believe we are going further. We are progressing. Lagos State Government has remembered Badagri with this. So we praise the government. We, our youths will benefit. At least I believe some of them will work here. Either as security, either, either as clerk, secretary is part of the benefit. Two, some may even come and sell here. Then they, they can even come and train some people here. So those are some of the benefits I think this thing and more that we bring to Badagri. It will keep our youth busy. And the uh, mineralization center, anybody can come around to come and relax here. Myself, I can equally come to come and relax here. And that is so it's a, it's a place we, we, that will benefit all of us. So I think nobody will want to say no to that. Now that the government is making the theater open to the public in this festive period, a planned visit to these edifices will not be out of place. It is indeed a sight to behold.